Hey squirrels, it's Tuesday, and I turned in my lit paper. Yeah, so I'm glad to be done with this paper. It means that I will have a life other than examining Chopin's cello sonata. I'll be able to eat lunch with you guys, which I haven't done this week yet. And maybe, maybe, maybe I can get some sleep. I was telling Allison earlier that um, my face should be a meme of me like yawning, something like this. And it would be called Overloaded College Freshman. Some examples of this would be try to take actual break over the weekend. Stayed up until four o'clock writing papers on Monday. Oh, happy 19th birthday. That's how many credit hours I took last semester. If anyone wants to make that happen, I would, uh, I would appreciate that. It would give me a laugh. In addition to being the day that my lit paper was due, it is also one day without shoes. So I have been barefoot since I got up this morning. Yep. It's not fun. It really is not. Walking around outside without any shoes. So, while I enjoy being barefoot, I, I would not want to live that way every day. Yeah. My last order of business before I get to this week's theme is that I made a short little montage clip like I talked about of my You Are Beautiful project. And so I'll probably put a link to that in the doobly-doo. I put that on my personal channel. So, you can go check that out if you want. And now for two truths and a lie. Statement one. In second grade, I wrote a 50 some odd page uh, story about being a ninja. <laughs> That was something I forgot to mention in my Nerd Week video. Statement number two. My first word was rectangle. Also something I forgot to mention in the Nerd Week video. And statement number three. Before we tried out different mouthpieces at the end of fifth grade, I wanted to play trumpet. So there you have it, squirrel friends. Two truths and a lie. Which one's the lie? Have fun figuring that one out. Audrey, I will see you tomorrow.